Sewing involves a bunch of little tools, and during a project these tend to end up scattered all around my workplace. I've been playing around with a solution for this in the back of my mind, and now I've finally made it real. My sewing tool knife block. I started by collecting my most used sewing tools and tracing their outlines. These will be my cutting templates later on. I also measured the thickness of the tools and drew cross sections of the slots that I'll need. These allowed me to play around with different layouts until I found one that I liked. I'm making the block out of lots of layers of thin plywood, which makes it a lot easier for me to cut the slots for the tools. I used two different thicknesses so I could play around with the size of the slots and get as close to what I need as possible. I cut the pieces to size on the table saw and organized them in the right order of thickness. I used the tool templates that I made to draw the cuts I need to make onto the pieces. Those that will need the same shape cut out of them got taped together, so I can cut them all at once on the bandsaw. That way they all match. My cuts weren't super straight, so I spent some time sanding them down to their final shape. Then I stacked them in the right order and got my first idea of how this will end up looking. It's a good thing that I bought a big bottle of glue, because I used quite a lot of it in the next couple of hours. Each piece got a layer of glue and I did my best to align them properly. Then into the clamps they go, allowing them to dry overnight. The pieces did shift a little bit in the clamps, but not enough to really cause a problem. Now I got to spend some quality time with the random orbit sander, as we smoothened out the sides of the block. A chisel and some files helped me even out the slots, which made a big difference in how it looked. I had a few more glue ups to go, because I wanted to add some extra storage options. These were again built up of different layers of plywood. The whole block needs to lean forward at a 15 degree angle, which I really should have cut when I was cutting the individual pieces. It was a bit tricky to do it at this point, but an angle table on the bandsaw, a bit of patience and a bunch more sanding got the job done. One final glue up, and it's finished. I also made a little block to go by the sewing machine, and I added some pins to it so that I can store extra spools and bobbins within easy reach. Loading these up with the tools was such a satisfying feeling. I do love a bit of organization, and having everything ready to go like this just makes me excited to get to work. Laura and I did a sewing project together the very next day, so go check out her video to see the tool block in action. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.